know I know the weather is cold Hi! It's our first training run day in Garmish and this is a very special race weekend for me because my dad's family is actually from Garmish and we have or they have a family home in the town and I've only ever been here in the summer so I'm so excited to be here and honestly I'm just really excited to see how it goes. It's a really cool looking track. Sorry, <laughs> a mask. Um, it's like not crazy icy and it's a little bit technical, but also a lot of gliding and yeah, touch on the skis. So hopefully that plays my advantage, but yeah, I'm really excited to be here. Just excited for the chance to try and race. So I'll keep you updated. <laughs> I ain't no regular Joe, you should've left me alone I'm in the zone, I'm where the predators roam We at the Senate in Rome, and I'm on the throne This ain't no regular poem, this ain't that regular tone, no Do you follow me, baby? Can you see what I have? Do you like what you see? Do I follow your path? I don't know if I like you, I just know that you bad Who you driving me crazy? You could drive in that cab Pop out if you don't like it, you gotta hop out Always been a player, never dropped out Grab a cop the necklace before I pop out She want attention, I play the field with my henchmen She want me back in detention, I study lessons I'm in a different dimension, I move in different directions We playing chess, she just gave me the address See the lady in the dress She the lady in my text, see the lady is a test These days I roll alone, trying to say the fuck up off the phone Trying to come the fuck up off the poems Not trying to get cuffed up, cuffs of stone Okay, so our training run's done, and I decided to go for a walk, but this is my family's old home, or my dad's family's old home. We used to stay at that, like, top part is, um, is owned by his cousins and stuff, so that up there where those windows are, that's where we used to stay when we come on, like, family vacations here, and then this yellow crane is one of our markers in the course. Isn't that funny? So you can actually see this from the course. But anyways, I thought that was really cute and kind of gives me a little sense of home when I'm here, which is really nice and makes this race really special for me. <laughs> Playing for keeps, I'm a top gun, she playing the sheets When the ops come, I play for my team, go play with yourself, stop playing with me Do you follow me, baby? Can you see what I have? Do you like what you see? Do I follow your path? I don't know if I like you, I just know that you bad Who you driving me crazy? You could drive in that cab uh, Pop out If you don't like it, you can hop out Always been a player, never dropped out Grab a cop the necklace before I pop out I say the shit with my chest, I lay the brick on my ex I had to go on a quest, I had to go on progress Some shit is hard to accept, I know I'll never forget And it's a bet, I keep my memory fresh, I hope my enemy's blessed everyone <laughs> so it is it was race day today um which is saturday the 29th i think but um yesterday i had a hard time getting any sort of footage just because it was a tough day for me i yeah i skied really well i it was really windy so they had to lower the start down to the super g start um and i wanted to really like step up and try to be more confident because the day the first training run i was definitely really scared but um yeah i stepped up and i ended up coming like 19th on the training run which is the closest i've been in a training run so far since coming onto the circuit and then I found out that I wouldn't be racing due to reasons beyond my control and so I kind of spent the afternoon figuring out why and just kind of dealing with some stuff but it was just very emotional because I 
really like this track. I think that it's just so cool how challenging it is and just like the, I don't know, story, history behind it. And obviously with my family kind of having history here, it was very like personal to me. But anyways, just was dealing with some emotions, trying to figure out how I was feeling and everything. But I ended up whatever, getting over it, dealing with it, putting my emotions aside and trying to figure out the best way to go about today. So I ended up for running today and it was a really cool experience. I haven't gone into a World Cup yet with feeling like no pressure just because obviously it's a, you put pressure on yourself anytime you're in a race, but I just kind of went out and skied and feel like I was able to kind of learn the track even more, which is awesome for me because I plan on being back here for many years to come, especially because I plan on staying on the speed circuit. So yeah, it was just overall a lot of learning. And I also got to be at the bottom of the course when all the top girls came down and I got to kind of listen in on some stuff they talked about and just kind of see how they acted which I haven't had the experience of yet because I start last usually <laughs> or a couple from last so I'm not usually around the top girls at the top or bottom but today I got to kind of see what they were up to and that was really cool for me and then I yeah got to help out my team and kind of give reports and try to tell them what was going on with the course but yeah it was a really cool experience I feel like I turned a very negative situation into something that I could learn from and could actually take a lot of positives away from but yeah I will not be racing tomorrow either in the Super G I'm gonna forerun again and then uh the Olympics a bunch of people are going to the Olympics and I'm gonna go do couple races in Italy and then fly back to Canada. Yay! I'm gonna get to race in Canada for a little bit, but I'm just packing because we're gonna leave tomorrow and go back to our apartments so that I can get packed to go back to the Norams. But just thought I'd update you on why <laughs> I literally did not show anything from yesterday because it wasn't a very positive day for me, but it also had a very negative and emotional few hours that kind of drained me. So yeah, that was what was going on. At the end of the day, I'm learning a lot and I have a great coach and friends and I have my family supporting me and I have lots of people at home. <laughs>